Hey guys, I hope that everybody's doing okay. I'm gonna be paying attention to the road, so I'm sorry if I'm not looking at the camera very much. But um, this is me talking, y'all. This is Zipporah talking to you guys. Person to person, woman to woman, woman to man, whoever's watching this video. There is something that God has placed inside of you. And it is something that you are so passionate about. It is something that you think about. It is something that you know God has put inside of you for you to do for his kingdom. It's a work that he has for you. And there are so many people in this world that are trying to stump our dreams, that are trying to stump us out, trying to make it seem like our dreams are invalid, trying to make us seem like we are invalid, you know? We are around so many evil, wicked, narcissistic people that don't believe in us, that are jealous, you know, whatever the reason it is, because you got to remember, wicked people, I know, like my mom was saying, wicked people, I'm sorry, narcissistic people are nothing but evil, demonic, wicked people that have been embodied by a demon, you know? <laughs> So their soul has been taken over by a demon. They gave their soul over to a demon or um, they're allowing demons to control them. Let's put it that way. And so these people a lot of times will tell us that we are nothing when they really know that we're everything. These people are trying to tell us that we are worth nothing, that our dreams are worth nothing, that we are not valid in this world, whatever the case may be, when they truly know that we are, you know, why else are they trying to suck us dry for everything that we have, you know, this is what these evil people do, it's because they don't have anything in them to fill them up, and so they're trying to take what they can get from you to fill them up. How can you carry your weight and the weight of them also? You know, <laughs> your dreams are valid. Take them to the Lord, pray over them, and God will make the way for you to have whatever it is that God has called you to have and whatever it is that God has called you to do. Don't let anyone take that away from you. You are still here because you have a work to do for God. You have something that's inside of you that only you can do. And I've mentioned that before. It doesn't matter how many people are doing that same thing that God has put inside of you to do. You can do it only the way that you can do it because you're different from everyone else. You're created different from everyone else. You have something inside of you that no one else has. It doesn't matter who else is doing that same thing because you might have a dream like Let's just say your dream is creating clothes, you know, you want to become a fashion designer. You can, you have something inside of you that only you have that God put you in, put inside of you to do, to create whatever it is that he has called you to create, whether if it's creating clothes, whether if it's starting a YouTube channel like I did, whether if it's going off, starting your own business, you know, a lot of us, a lot of us are told somebody else is doing it you need to find something else your dream is not valid but that's not true guys don't let anyone take that away from you I have been in a relationship since I was 15 years old with a, with with a man I have had children since I was 16 years old so I really didn't get to have the dreams that I wanted to have even from a young, young girl. And I always said, if, if you gave me the chance, Lord, to do whatever it is that you put inside of me when I was little, I'm going to do it, you know? I am going to do it. And I'm telling you guys, do it. Don't be afraid. Don't let anyone tell you not to do it. Don't let anybody tell you that you're less than or that you're not this and you're not that or that you don't have this or you don't have that. Don't look at the circumstances that you have. God will make the way. Pray over it. Don't let anyone stomp your dreams out. Go after those dreams. Go after what that what it is that God has put inside of you to do. You can do it. Only you can do it the way God has called you to do it. You're unique. You're special. You're amazing. You're awesome. You're beautiful. You're wonderful. You know? Because God created you, you're still here to do it. So go do it. I love y'all. I hope y'all have a wonderful day. Bye.